Hey guys, Shit the Chitty Light here, back with an other light tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can fade in and fade out your audio clips on GarageBand. So first things first, you need to select your audio track. And here I don't have any audio track, so I'm just going to go to Apple Loops and select an audio track which I like the best. Okay, so I like this. I'm just gonna import this track right there and loop it around there. Okay, so next thing I'm gonna want to do is just have a good listen. And now I'm gonna record myself saying something in another track so in case there's a podcast or something hey guys this is Shitich. so right there I've recorded it now if this was a podcast I would want to keep my audio track with the music I need some background music so I'll go to mix show automation or A and now it's showing me the automation so right here and uh, there's a line here you can just click on this audio track once uh, twice to get that line and that's how you can control your fade in and fade out the bottom dot controls your audio and the top dot controls your audio so if you have your audio high up you can uh, notice here that the volume control is going up and down and uh, that's fading out fading out you can even keep it at a distance there and have a good listen if we focus on the volume bar right there it's reducing as we fade out I couldn't get my audio clip sorry but this works you can see it right there so I'm just gonna set try from a higher look at it go right there so if I, even if I can't play the audio you know that the volume goes up and down so that's how fade in and fade out for audio clips on GarageBand works thank you for watching and for more light tutorials and tech reviews Subscribe to Shit That Shitty Light and like this video. See you in the next video. Until then, bye.